Hello friends, let us explore today how we can make use of the algebraic tiles provided in the maths kit prepared by NCERT. Here we have blue tiles and red tiles. As you can see, this is a square tile representing x square and we have another tile here representing minus x square. This tile represents x and we have another tile representing minus x. We also have tiles representing 1 and minus 1. Now, let us see how we can make use of these tiles to study about the factorization of a quadratic polynomial. For that, let us take up an example. We have here x square plus 5x plus 6. For this, as we can see, we shall make use of the tiles. We have here, we will require one x square, 5 x tiles and 6 tiles of 1. Here we have 3 tiles, we arrange, we will try to arrange them in such a manner that they form a rectangle. Let us see here, these are 2 tiles and now we will require 6 tiles of 1. Yes, does it form a rectangle? Yes, here see this side is representing x plus 3 and here we have x plus 2. That means, we can factorize this quadratic polynomial x square plus 5x plus 6 as x plus 3 into x plus 2. In this manner, x square plus 5x plus 6 can be split as x plus 3 into x plus 2. Now, let us take up one more example. Here we have x square minus x minus 6. For this, as you can see, we require 1 x square tile, we require 1 x tile of minus x, this is 1 x tile and we require 6 of 1 minus 1. So, if we arrange, as you can see this is not forming a rectangle. So, what should we do? We should add some tiles to this so that it forms a rectangle. For that, we will take 3 minus x tiles, 2 tiles of plus x. Only then we will be able to get minus x and 6 of 1 minus 1. We have here minus 1, 4 and this is 5 and 6. Yes, it forms a rectangle. Now, what are the sides of this rectangle? x minus 3 and x plus 2. That means, we can factorize this term as x minus 3 into x plus 2. Let us take up one more example. Here we have an interesting quadratic polynomial 2x square minus 7x plus 6. As you can see, we will require 2 tiles of x square. This is one tile. One more we will take of x square. Now, minus 7 that means, I will require 3 tiles of minus x and 4 tiles of again minus x and to complete this rectangle, we shall require 6 tiles of 1. Yes, it forms a rectangle. 
Now you can see uh, this side will be x plus x that is 2 x minus 3 and this side will be of x minus 2. So, it forms a rectangle with sides 2 x minus 3 and x minus 2. So, 2 x square minus 7 x plus 6 can be factorized as 2 x minus 3 into x minus 2. So, we can explore so many factors for various quadratic polynomials using these interesting algebraic tiles. Thank you.